Hello and welcome to another class of AWS. So today in this class we are going to discuss about how to launch and connect to a Linux instance. So in today's class or in this exercise we will launch a new instance or Linux instance and then we will log to security updates. So these are the various services. So now we are in a third chapter in which we are dealing with EC2 which is Elastic Compute Cloud. So here in this we have number of running instances. We can see our region. It supports this thing virtual private cloud. These are the documentation and the, yeah. if we talk about the service health that means we know about the availability zones in our region. So these are the availability zones. So it check out that number of availability zones that are working or operating normally. So we require to create an instance. So here in this case, like we have to launch an instance. So when I click on a launch an instance, so this is uh, the instance. Now we have to choose the very first thing. These are the steps. First thing we have to choose AMI. Then we have to choose instance type. After that, we require to configure instances, add storage, add tags, and then we require to configure the security cubes. And after that, we have review. So first of all, we require to choose an AMI, which is Amazon Machine Image. So AMI is basically a template which contains software configuration. That means what is the operating system, application server, and various applications which are required for launching an instance so we can select a AMI AMI which is provided by AWS so we have Amazon Linux AMI 2016 0.09.1 SSD volume type let's select this after that we have various types of instances available now these are the number of the instances available as per their network performance support for IPv6 in instance storage which is in JB so we can check as per our requirement like we have free tire eligible general purpose let's review this or we can configure instance instances also now what are the number of instances we require number of instances purchasing option what is the network subnet ID IP, IM role, shutdown behavior, stop, or we require termination protection. Whatever the things that we require to live, we have to configure the instances here. We can create our new VPC also. After that, we can add a storage, the fourth step. This the storage is volume type root. We have a device, we can use the snapshot, size is this volume type, IOPS per second, termination encrypted. We can add storage also. Final tag, we have to add tag also, we can add tag. We can configure our security groups as well. After that we can review whatever the things that we have done. If we require to change, we can go to the previous and we have we can make a changes in this or we can select anything whatever we require this is the interface of the instances in EC2 we will continue with this in our next class